This hackathon, first of all, it's the largest European defense hackathon ever made. Welcome to the biggest defense hackathon in Europe. Welcome to Copenhagen. Welcome to Paris. 250 engineers. One mission. Secure the future of Europe and save lives. Actually, the more drones, the more unmanned systems will bring to the war, the more people come back to their home, to their beloved people. I think we have an alternative future where we send increasingly autonomous systems, but that only happens if we work on the problem. Human rights should not be taken for granted. We've been fighting for decades and generations to have those liberties and we must be strong and sovereign to defend them if we have to. I believe our best as a society when we have people who care deeply about human rights, working on defence, making sure that the systems we develop today protect people's safety in 10 years, 20 years time from now. Most of the engineers during the interview are saying like, I want to make an impact. There is no bigger impact than this. You can save literally thousands of lives. Thousands of people will come back to their beloved ones from this war, from future wars, simply because you innovated and you made some unmanned system which saved someone's lives. Hi, my name is Lokesh and I'm CTO of Separate Intelligence. We are building autonomous system for detection of covered and hidden objects. And what we're building is a identification system for uh, drones in Ukraine, so we can differ uh, fixed-wing drones from uh, Russian fixed-wing drones. We are here at the Hackathon to develop a uh, detection of shahets by sound and thermal imaging. And we are building underwater autonomous navigation for drones. To track and detect drones in, uh, in difficult and challenging uh, vision scenarios. We are working on uh, event-based tracking for UAVs and uh, shahet drones directly from the ground and from the air. Why am I here? <laughs> the answer is very simple. Europe needs more defense startups.